Today I'm going to show you something really cool in Dark Souls 3. At the beginning, after you fight the first boss, if you run off to the left of the Firelink Shrine, you encounter a guy that's uh, kind of like a naked green looking dude that has a katana and he kicks your ass after one or two hits. And he's really tough and obviously the first thought is, well, I'll just come back and fight him later because that ain't worth it. <laughs> um, you know, Dark Souls lives matters, right? But um, for real, there is a really easy way to cheese him. All you need is a bow, uh, maybe magic if you're good. Uh, with using magic spells like uh, staff, uh, particularly, um, and a uh, bunch of arrows is all you need. Uh, even if you don't have a class that is able to sufficiently use the bow, like if you don't have the required 14 dexterity, it is still plenty doable because I did this trick with a knight with only 12 dexterity uh, using the bow. So um, enjoy! I hope you guys uh, find these tips very handy. I'm just going to show you a little bit of footage and show you exactly what I did and uh, hope you enjoy. So there's a trick where you can actually get a certain item without having to buy the key, which is awesome. Because the item is a Estus Shard, which means you can get an extra Estus Flask easily at the beginning of the game. That's pretty sweet, so we're going to try that. I didn't even know about this until uh, I watched a Vati Vidya video. <laughs> so clever, right? But yeah, supposedly you can run off this tree and jump. Like if you do it at the right angle, you like run up the tree a little bit and then you can jump over. And it looked like I almost made it actually. I just didn't have the angle right. I think the devs put the shit in here on purpose just so that the get good people can have like a little bit, you know, more things to find and get a little bit of an early, uh, you know, advantage or shortcut for, I guess, speed running purposes. And what, oh, I fucking did it. Well, that's how you do it. Um, you know, I, okay, Homeward Bone. Well, that's not what I wanted, but uh, maybe it'll be around. There's the Katana guy. Oh, shit. <laughs> He's aggroed on me, even though he can't get to me. That's pretty funny. Wait, could he possibly get to me from there? No, he couldn't. But you know what? If you had, like, a fucking archer, this is the way to take him out. Just snipe him. That's so awesome. got him right where you want him. Oh, uh, wait. No, it literally doesn't let you use the arrows. Really? Oh, wait. Yes. So even though I have totally crap stats, I can still shoot him. You know what? I've got my magic. I guess I could use that too. Um, so let's try the spell out. Okay. Hopefully it doesn't launch me off the cliff here. Fuck it does! Okay. Gotta run. Gotta run, gotta run, gotta run right now. <laughs> that went pretty terribly there. There we go, now we're cooking. Oh, it actually does worse damage than the arrows did, but might as well use them up while I got some magic. Okay, so it looks like we're about done with uh, Uchi Katana guy. He's only got like a couple more arrows to shoot him with and he's dead. There he is. So that's how you cheese him. You get 2,200 souls for taking that effort. And you get an Uchi Katana, a Master's Attire, and a Master's Glove. Um, all great items to have if you want to, uh, you know, have that stuff, and you can't open that door, so. But that's, that's what you gotta do to, to cheese him up. I hope you guys enjoyed this little clip, uh, of Boring Souls, where I just, you know, exploited the AI as much as I possibly could to not have to actually fight myself. And, um, but yeah, I hope you guys uh, enjoyed it, you know, if you want to easy way to grab the Uchi Katana early on uh, without risking yourself getting killed a hundred times by that guy, then that's definitely a way to do it. So hope you enjoyed it. So, uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. If you uh, like this kind of stuff, you know, you can also watch me stream Dark Souls 3 and plenty of other games here right on my YouTube channel. So, uh, till then, down Phoenix out.